the writing of the of the first album was basically a reaction to what I was hearing from my parents and exercising some of that out of myself. We were looking to make Christian death like serious, like dangerous, a real threat. In early Christian death, they'd be playing like big shows, and so as they walked out, I'd hear some guy go, "Damn, that bitch is ugly!" Like that, <laughs> and never dawned on that naive, hardcore fans that that could be a drag queen. A certain first wave which just started to think noise and swearing and yelling about death was enough. But that's not what Christian Death were doing. They were writing songs. Roz, Roger grew up in a household that was very religious. And being like this sort of gay, visionary artist, it's got to be tough. He was always looking for love, always looking for love. And I think that's what ultimately destroyed Roz. It does not surprise me at all that he became famous. I almost expected it.